And now we're bringing you in-depth coverage on a story you saw first on WPRI.com. The Rhode Island state government right now working on its biggest ever IT project. The cost for it has nearly tripled to $364 million to get a sense of what's going on here. WPRI.com reporter Ted Nisi joins us to talk about it. So, Ted, this is a project that I think a lot of people haven't even heard of, and we're talking about a lot of money. That's right. I've been keeping an eye on this. It's called the UHIP project, the Unified Health Infrastructure Project. And we've been keeping an eye on it for a number of years because it's so big. It's the biggest IT project, as you said, the state's ever done. The cost was initially supposed to be about $130 million, and now we've seen it go up and up. The whole point of it is to create a new computer system that will do two things, manage Obamacare, HealthSource RI, the local insurance marketplace to carry out that law, and public assistance programs such as the old welfare program, Medicaid, etc. They tried to do it all as one big project thinking that would save money. So how did this happen? I mean, the tripling is, is that's pretty striking. So how did that happen? That's one of the things we're still looking for answers on. I mean, we had an initial cost of about $130 million. Now we're up to 360. The federal government's covering a lot of that, but not all of it. State officials tell me they still are happy with the work being done by Deloitte, the contractor carrying it out, and there's been no change in scope, which just raises the question of why the estimate was so low initially compared to what's happening now. So you have been talking with state officials about it. Have they told you anything else about where this project stands? Right now they're trying to keep a, a happy face on this. They say they're pleased with the work that Deloitte, the contractor, is doing and that things are moving along, but there's also been a lot of reports of problems with this UHIP project so far. HealthSource RI has complained it made it harder to roll out Obamacare in the state because of various defects and technical issues. They've been pushing back the timeline for getting it done, which means they're still using the old expensive system to manage this. So it's important for the state to get this done, especially when so much money's been gone out the door already. But people are going to increasingly wonder how big is the cost going to be in the end. Yeah, we'll keep our eye on it. Thank you very much, Ted.